Hi there, my name is Dan, and in this video, I'll be going through the exact questions I got in my life in the UK test in late 2020. For each question, I'll show the multiple choice options, and I recommend pausing the video to have a go yourself before I reveal the answer. Let's jump in. Question one reads, who was reigning during the time colonies were first established in America? Henry VIII, Elizabeth I, Charles II, or George I? The correct answer is Elizabeth I. Question 2 reads, what year were women given the right to vote at the same age as men? 1918, 1928, 1945, or 1969? The correct answer is 1928. 1918 was the first year women were granted the ability to vote at the age of 30, when men could vote at 21. And in 1969, men and women could both vote at the age of 18. 1945 has no significance for the voting age. Question 3. The execution of which monarch led to England becoming a republic? Charles I, Charles II, Henry VII, or James II? The correct answer is Charles I. Question 4. Edinburgh is the capital of which country? England, Wales, Scotland, or Northern Ireland? The correct answer is Scotland. Question 5. Great Britain refers to England, Wales, Scotland, and Northern Ireland. True or false? This statement is false. Great Britain specifically refers to England, Wales, and Scotland, not Northern Ireland. Question 6. Sir Robert Walpole is known as a landscape painter, inventor of television, a poet, or Britain's first Prime Minister. The correct answer is Britain's first Prime Minister. Question 7. The daffodil is the national flower of which country? England, Wales, Scotland, or Northern Ireland? The correct answer is Wales. The national flower of England is the rose, the national flower of Scotland is the thistle, and the national flower of Northern Ireland is the shamrock. St Andrew's Day is celebrated on which date? The 1st of March, the 17th of March, the 23rd of April, or the 30th of November? The correct answer is the 30th of November. The 1st of March is St David's Day, the 17th of March is St Patrick's Day, and the 23rd of April is St. George's Day. It's really important to know these dates as they are often assessed in the test. Question 9. Who was the first Archbishop of Canterbury? St. Patrick, St. Augustine, St. Andrew, or St. Columba? The correct answer is St. Augustine. Question 10. The Turner Prize is an award in which category? Literature, music, contemporary art, or theatre? The correct answer is contemporary art, and the prize is named after Joseph Turner, a famous artist. Question 11. The minimum age for buying alcohol in the UK is 21. True or false? This statement is false. The correct age is 18. Question 12. How many members does a jury have in England, Wales, and Northern Ireland? 10, 12, 15, or 20? The correct answer is 12. In Scotland, they have 15 on the jury. Question 13. Which two houses fought in the English Civil War of 1642? House of York, House of Liverpool, House of Bristol, and House of Lancaster. The correct answers are House of York and House of Lancaster. Question 14. Who was the leader of the suffragettes? the group that campaigned for a woman's rights to vote. Was it Emmeline Pankhurst, Florence Nightingale, Jane Austen, or Mary Peters? The correct answer is Emmeline Pankhurst. Question 15. Who invented the jet engine? Sir Tim Barnes-Lee, Oliver Cromwell, Frank Whittle, or Robert Burns? The correct answer is Frank Whittle. Question 16. Which of the following is a fundamental principle of British life? Communism, intolerance, individual liberty, or violence? The correct answer is individual liberty. Questions involving British values are fairly obvious to answer. 
You can usually spot the correct answer fairly easily as the incorrect answers are blindingly obvious. Question 17. Which charity works to preserve important buildings, coastline and countryside in the UK? Shelter, Age UK, Crisis or the National Trust? The correct answer is the National Trust. Question 18. St. Helena is a British Overseas Territory and is part of the United Kingdom. True or false? The correct answer is false. This question can seem a bit tricky because St. Helena is a British Overseas Territory, but it is not part of the UK, whereas this question says it is part of the UK. And therefore the answer is false. Question 19. Which of the following UK landmarks is located in Northern Ireland? Big Ben, the Lake District, Snowdonia, or Giant's Causeway? The correct answer is Giant's Causeway. And from the official guide, this is the only landmark located in Northern Ireland. Question 20. Haggis is a traditional food from which area? Northern Ireland, Wales, Scotland, or England? The correct answer is Scotland. Question 21. The members of the House of Lords, known as peers, are elected by the people. True or false? This statement is false. Members of the House of Lords, or peers, are elected by the monarchy on advice of the Prime Minister and are not elected by the people. Question 22. What are the 40 days before Easter called? Diwali, Lent, Hanukkah or Christmas? The correct answer is Lent. Question 23. Anyone can make a complaint about the police by writing to the Chief Constable of the Police Force. True or false? This statement is true. Question 24. What sort of event is the Grand National? Rugby, golf, horse racing or tennis? The correct answer is horse racing. Thanks for watching and I hope you found these tips useful. I'm on a mission to help you better prepare for the life in the UK test. I've made an easy to follow and enjoyable video course where I've completely stripped down the material to focus on what you actually need to know for the questions that are actually asked. To show your support, Please subscribe to my channel by clicking here, and to get started with my course for free, click here. I wish you the best of luck in the test.